じゃあな Welcome back, YouTube. This is Artman Advanced, and unfortunately, I'm having some troubles with the PlayStation 2, so instead, I will be bringing you a special Let's Play. Dragon Warrior Monsters. Copyright 2000 by Armor Project, Bird Studio, and Enix. I actually had a save file on this game, one that I was very proud of. I was all the way up to rank A and I was still training my monsters. The second I put it in my Super Game Boy to test it out, it glitched. Well, that's alright. It gives me a chance to let's play this game for you. It gives me a reason to. So, let's get to it. That's an interesting story. And we are up and about, ignoring our sister's orders. Hmm, our sister's teddy bear. Let's see. Bookshelf. Wee boy and little girl in a village. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Uh oh. Fireplace. My clothes? So that must mean. Uh huh. Her clothes. Let's see what's in here. What the? Who is this? No, we are not Mielu. How do you pronounce the name? Malayu. That is a very clumsy name. Warubo. From the Kingdom of Great Log. Don't you forget it. Ow, that was rude. And he's dragging our sister away. We gotta. Come on. That... Oh no, oh no! Milayu. Milayu. I will learn how to pronounce that name eventually. I speak monster talk. Let's follow him. We got nothing else to do. Oh, it changed. I honestly wasn't expecting that. I like the visual, though. Okay, 
creepy old man. My SP. Weird. Maybe it's because I was playing it on a Game Boy Advance system instead of Super Game Boy. This kingdom is created inside a big tree. We are at the bottom. The castle is at the top. Makes sense. Seems legit, bro. Looks like a library. of a slime. Hey, is he the new master Wanaboo brought here? Yes, indeed. I'm taking him to see the king. Good luck at the Starry Night Tournament. That's interesting. Now it's time to go see the king. I'm the minister of this kingdom. Are you the new master? His Majesty has a favor to ask you. Please comply with his request. Okay. Welcome! I am the king of this kingdom. Identify yourself, my child. You know what? Just for the heck of it, I'm gonna stay Terry. My wish is nothing but for you to participate and win the Tournament of the Starry Night. What? You say you would rather find your kidnapped sister? Didn't you come here to comply with my request? Hmm. Hmm. However, there is an easier way than searching for, your, for her. Win the Tournament of the Starry Night. Legend has it that the one who is victorious in the Tournament of the Starry Night will be granted a wish. Your wish to find your sister will be granted. That way we both win. Meanwhile, search for your sister while you prepare for the tournament. Here, I shall give you some monsters. Without any monsters, you cannot serve as a master. The monster farm is on the upper level. Go and ask Julio for your monsters. What? Terry? 
You have something to say? What? You will catch hail to free Punia? You say you will catch hail? Hmm? Sounds interesting. You may try, Terry. Uh, Majesty, hail escape and traveler's gate. I see. Now, Terry, proceed to the traveler's gate. If you bring hail back, I will pardon Punia. The treasure chest in the next room is now yours. Ask the minister about it. You are dismissed. Busy, busy, busy. He always does this. Alright, well, he said we got some treasure coming to us, so... When you enter the Traveler's Gate, you will be sent to an alien world. There are magical halls in the Mystic World. And you can walk to the next level of the world through the holes. You should be able to come back when you defeat the monster on the last level. During the adventure, if you want to see the map of where you've been, press the select button. But it works only when you are in the mystic world. That's good to know. I have a feeling that your victory will help you find your sister. understand monster talk and are able to tame them. There are few masters who can understand and tame monsters. It is important not only to understand them, but also to be liked by them. There are masters from this world, and masters who are brought by Watapu, who is the spirit of Great Tree. Terry looked at the bookshelf. The Kingdom of Great Tree. Yes, let's read it. It's a little kingdom built inside a big tree. Other kingdoms are also built in big trees. All the kingdoms have something called Traveler's Gate. Beyond the gates are the mystic worlds where the monsters live. When the Starry Night Tournament nears, Great Tree trembles. It's a sign that Great Tree is growing. Alright, the first level shoot... the first world is really short, so I think I'll fit it into this video and then call it recording. Traveler's Gates, little master. Ooh, it changed again. I actually kind of like this background. But I've got to figure out if there's a way to change the color scheme because all this yellow is kind of irritating. This game really pops when it's in full color. Uh-oh. Monster battle. Anteater. Let's fight. Things. If you're ever 
in danger, you just throw it up and you can instantly transport it back to the castle. Let's see. Ah, I'm missing a key item, but did you notice that? Field 3 of 4, that means we only need to descend two more times to get where we need to go. I'm gonna try to stock up on as much gold as I can get because there is one item that I cannot really play this game without properly. Alright, here we go. I am not really sure about how well prepared I am, but all we've got to lose is like half our items. We don't have any real gold, I don't believe. go up against hail well we are royally screwed part about herbs is that we get one every time we return from the, uh, from the monster world. Alright. This has got to be the worst first fight I ever had. I'll be lucky to actually make it. Yep. I knew he was going to do that. Well, you guys saw how it works, so... Let's see... Give him the creature power of great tree. For safe journey, I'll give you an herb. See? We get an herb every time. Let's see... We've got no gold. We've only got an herb. For now, I'm going to save it. Thank you for watching, and I'll be back with more later.